On Saturday, September 14th, I had the absolute privilege of meeting both Billy Piper and Christopher Eccleston at Rose City Comic Con. This was Christopher Eccleston's very first U.S. convention. I know he has just very recently started to go to conventions and see fans and things. I literally couldn't believe I was in the same room as these people, Billy Piper and Christopher Eccleston, let alone, you know, actually talking to them face to face. It was incredible. And like, this is a very self-indulgent video. I'm going to be honest about that. Yeah, sorry, it was just unbelievable. I literally couldn't believe it. I shook Christopher Eccleston's hand, and he was very nice, very sweet. It was an honor to meet them. I, I was just absolutely, I guess the word would be starstruck, just meeting these people. Like, I wish I had said more to them, but I was just, just, I just, I was just stunned, and I couldn't say much. But I, I did talk with them a little bit, and that was lovely. They were so sweet. And... Yeah, I, I... I was so happy. The first one that I met was Billy Piper. Um, early in the morning, around 11, 11.30. I was queued up in the line, and she was there. And Christopher Eccleston was also there on the right. And I, I could see him, and it was crazy. I was like, there's Christopher Eccleston. And then he was out first, and then a little bit later, Billy Piper came out. Uh, and everyone applauded when she came out. Um, so I, I believe I did see Christopher Eccleston first. But the first one that I met was Billy Piper. And I was in that line for probably a good 35, 40 minutes. And then I finally got to the end. And, I, like, I, I just couldn't believe I was there. And... and it was it was incredible and she was for for a brief moment she was talking to her uh, assistant as i got there i don't know his name he's a person um and then she realized there was there's a you know another person in front of her and she immediately turned around and, and started talking to me uh sorry yeah she she was lovely and then um you'll i'm sure see on screen the autograph that i got from both of them billy piper Christopher Eccleston, the doctor. And then I was just so happy after walking away holding uh, Billy Piper's autograph and after having met her. And I was just smiling for a long time after that. And then next, I met Christopher Eccleston. And that was unbelievable. Yeah, I don't really care too much that this video is self-indulgent. That's a, a straight-up lie. I totally care. I'm a little bit worried that, you know, that's a bad thing, but it, it is what it is. I was just unbelievably happy to meet these people. They were lovely. The panel that they they did, which um, was an 80-minute panel, that the first 40 minutes was Billy Piper, this, the next 40 minutes was Christopher Eccleston. And when it's broken up that way, then it, it kind of makes sense, because it's a shame that they're not on the panel together. But, you know, if you have the panel broken up, then they're going to get equal questions. It's not going to be the majority of the questions go to one person. Because if you have a doctor and a companion, odds are the majority of the questions are going to go to the doctor, because it's the doctor. You know, but if you break it down that way, then, well, it's going to be more even. Anyway, delightful. They were both wonderful. Incredible. Lovely. People. Very sweet. I was, I knew, I, 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 I knew they would be nice, but I, there are people that I would be ner nervous to meet, and I, of course, was nervous to meet them, I, you know, I barely said anything to them, um, because I, I, like, I didn't tell them how much I loved their work, or how much I loved them and their characters in Doctor Who, or anything like that, or, or ask them questions, I, I was just too, I was just, I just couldn't, it was too much for me, <laughs> maybe next time I, I meet someone, I'll, I'll be able to, um, work up the nerve, but, but yeah. I see a lot of negativity online, and after meeting Billy Piper specifically, because she was the first one that I met, after meeting Billy Piper, I was just so happy. There was nothing wrong with the world. I was just so, so, so happy, and I was just holding the paper, shaking, walking away, and I was so happy, I was smiling, I couldn't stop smiling. 
and it just made me want to keep that feeling forever. And it was all positive. There was nothing negative about that experience or, or holding that paper or looking at it. It was all so positive. It just made me want to not engage in negativity as much. I don't know. And just, 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 um, just seeing the panel really made me want more episodes with these people. It really, really did. I just wanted more episodes with Billy Piper, Chris Eccleston, and Billy Piper and David Tennant. I just wanted more of them. And then it made me remember, oh, there's Big Finish. There's audios I haven't listened to yet. I listened to the David Tennant Adventures Volume 1, but there's still the second one. And the third one. And the second one has Billy Piper in it. And then Billy Piper has her own thing coming out. Um, Earth Defense, I think it's called. I'm not 100% sure. So that's that's exciting. Of course, it's just not the same. Because there's a very specific feeling to that Doctor Who that was made in 2005, 2006. You know, or released. There's a very, very specific feeling. And Big Finish can capture that to an extent. But, you know, obviously not perfectly. So anyway, that's all for now, folks. Um, do you ha did you have any special experiences meeting anyone recently? I know there have been a couple of conventions up in um, in over in the UK in London. I know there have been a couple of those, so I imagine there are people that went to those and met people like Tom Baker and maybe I don't know who else was around those ones, but I know Tom Baker was was at one recently um, around the same time as Chris Freckleston was was down here. So uh, anyway, did you have any special experiences recently? Be sure to let me know. I would. Love to hear um, of, of any experiences you had meeting these people. So yeah, that's going to be for now. Thank you for watching. Take care, and have a lovely week.